The taboo over working with cancer is being broken down. A European project has developed a program to help people with long-term illnesses return to or stay in their jobs if they want to. People like Sandrine. It's an illness that can lead to depression very quickly. But knowing we have people around us and we have employers who are understanding and who support us gives us more strength to recover and move forward. For two years now, Sandrine has been undergoing treatment for breast cancer at the Oscar Lombre Hospital in Lille, France. For her, returning to work is essential to her recovery. With her oncologists, she's taking part in I Know How, a European pilot project that aims to increase by 15% the number of patients with long-term illnesses who return to work. One of the fruits of the project is this booklet, available in digital format. There are cards about announcing the illness, should I tell my employer. People can click directly on useful links. So, for example, they can go to the social security site to see what a pre-recovery visit is. The aim is to accompany patients from very early on to find out what's suitable for them. The total budget is 4 million euros, of which 2.4 million were provided by the European Cohesion Policy. France, Belgium, the Netherlands and the United Kingdom are participating in the pilot project that brings together caregivers, municipalities, companies and hundreds of patient volunteers. Sandrine is back at work. Thanks to the contributions from the various participants, a roadmap has been drawn up for companies. The document provides information and advice on how to reconcile the needs of the employee with the employer's perspective. HR plays a key role. He should be open about discussing everything, including with the employee, because ultimately they have fewer taboos than we do about managing this subject. The employee can also be the source of proposals around returning to work. We have to do everything we can to try to get him or her to come back if they want to. If the employee isn't involved, it's useless. The triangular framework of doctors, patients and companies is cemented by training, in which good practices are shared between partners. Still a lot needs to be done, also in terms of law, uh, of culture, of change of um, mental ideas about uh, return to work and uh, what place work has in people's lives. I know how builds on this, going further together.